Hello everybody. It's winter. It's really cold. Who knew? Anyway, I'm well tucked up. Um, but here's something to warm the cockles of your heart. We're going to be having a, this is only a quick video. It's going to be a quick little video about a new library I've come across, which I really like, which I thought I'd share with you. Um, it's uh, Dan Keane's Soft String Textures, uh, currently uh, on sale at uh, 79 uh, pounds, dollars, euros, whatever. Um, normal price is 99. So anyway, I'll put a link in it down below. What this does is, why this is cool, um, is, uh, let me get it up for you and I'll show you. Right, uh, it does this. It's got kind of little bobbly bits in it. It's got kind of little, um, what he calls soft string pert spurs. Uh, it's got staggered tremolos, listen. It sounds really kind of modern in a weird, why does that sound? It just doesn't sound straight. It sounds interesting. And so rather than just a, mm, I'm a violin, it's, mm, I'm a really interesting violin, like that, you see? And I think, you know, for the money, what you're getting is a touch of a contemporary, a much more contemporary sort of human real sound. So that's why I'm interested in this. Um, let's, um, let's get back to this and I'll, I mean, we'll just, play around with it. I tell you, let's, let's add some reverb to it because I think that would happen. There you go. Right, so you've got the choice of, so we've had the stack of tremolos, what about the harmonic whistles, okay. Oh no, where's that? You can imagine this in a sort of Nordic noir thing, can't you? Sporadic trills, major second. And what's the other one? Minor third. Okay, so what I thought, that's how it works. And you've got violin, viola, and uh, cello. And then you also get um, some things they call warps, which are kind of sort of sound designery, mashup y type stuff. But let's just stick with this for the time. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put down, uh, here we go. Here we go. Look. Okay, sorry. I'm... So they have these other things. Okay, so they have the three instruments. Okay, let's go back to the instruments. Here we go. Right, so you get soft string textures, cello, violin, and viola, all very good. And then you get warps. And the warps are kind of, no, it's, uh, yes, I do want to replace it. Let's see what they do. They do this. Oh, it's rather nice, actually. So it's a sort of synthesized version of using these as a starting point and adding some synths and stuff like that. Um, but look, let's let's stick, let's stick with our basic violin thing here um, and create something really simple. Here's Ashlight, which is uh, part of the new complete thing. It's one of these, it's a really good, this is, Ashlight for me, like Straylight and Farlight. If you haven't come across these, they're part of the complete Native Instruments Complete thing, whatever that is called, collection. Um, and they're sort of granular synthesis things. It's like, you remember when everybody got into Omnisphere and they went, oh, it sounds so great. It's like that, but for 2023, it sounds really good. <laughs> Trouble is, I always use the first one which comes up because it always sounds so good. So therefore, I'm going to just choose comatose condition um, and see what that sounds like instead. Oh, it's a bit. That is too aggressive for what I, I I want a paddy thing really. I want a paddy thing. So it's too overflight. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'll go with all that. Uh, one more. Go on, just try one more. 
Uh, what are we going to go for instead? What I'm going to do is just put a very simple, I'm after a simple pattern actually, I'm, it's not what I'm getting anytime anymore. That'll do. Okay, right, we're going to put one of these down. as a base to put some of the Dan Keen stuff over the top and see if we don't end up with a Nordic Noir. Okay, now let's add viola because I, as you know, if ever I'm testing string libraries, I always go to the viola because it's the one which they kind of probably do love. Oh, got to do the violin right. Oh yeah, but got to get the cello. Oh, how much time we got left? Uh, viola. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Let's see. Yeah. Okay, that sounds nice. Let's have lots of reverb. Okay, which of these are we going for? Uh, Harmonic whistles, staggered tremolo. Okay, let's just stick with soft, soft tremolo thing. Okay, let's get this uh, uh, rolling. Right. See what happens when I. What key are we in? F. It's gone very quiet. <laughs> two controllers at once. Silly old me. You see how this might work? Okay, uh, a bit of space designer. Uh, what's going on here? Let's go, let's reset, that's recall default. That's better, we'll go for synthesized. Let's have something, uh, let's make it a bit long. Uh, 4.6, that's quite long, isn't it? So let's see how this sounds now. Right, uh, see if we've got a bit of Nordic noir going on in the background. Like it. It sounds like that. So if you are after that kind of touch of sort of thing, um, this is a pretty affordable way of getting it. Um, because there are other libraries which sort of head in that kind of direction, the whole Evo thing, but it's a much bigger deal. And these are just nice and easy to use. And you can drop them into an arrangement. And so. Congratulations, Dan. Young lad, doing great work. Like to encourage people who are um, creating interesting stuff like that. So go you. So go and check it out. And if that rings your bell, job done. Okay, see you again soon.